Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, sir. How you doing out there this morning? Good, I hope. I hope you're having a great morning. Hope you have a great day. So what's going on this morning? How you guys doing with that challenge I laid on you there? The light and the burden of another challenge. You doing anything with that? Huh? What's up? What are you waiting for? Get on it. Go lighten the burden of somebody today. All right, that's enough of that. You know, just checking in. Oh yeah, one more public service announcement. Use your damn blankets for crying out loud. What are you trying to do? Get in an accident? Cause somebody else get in an accident? Create road rage? Blinky blinky. It's real simple. Turn it on, people know where you're going. Saves a lot of stress. All right. Hey, who is it that's uh, your worst problem? Well, generally it's me. I'm my own worst problem. When I'm angry and attacking people and lashing out, I feel like crap. I just don't feel good. Things ain't right, nothing's good. The world sucks, everything sucks. When I reach out in love and help someone and do what I can to be a better person, I feel good. So I guess it's kind of up to me about how I feel. I think that's pretty much the same with everybody. What's going on in your mind is gonna dictate how you feel. If you got resentment rolling around or anger or hatred or some bullshit, you're not gonna feel good. You're gonna be tense, your stomach's gonna be churning, you're gonna be, heads are gonna be going, you're not gonna be paying attention, you're gonna be missing the day. But if I'm feeling good and I'm in thinking about uh, good things in my head and having a positive attitude and, and uh, reaching out to help people and doing what I can to be a decent human being, I feel good. I feel good, I'm present, I'm enjoying the day. I'm able to be here and see what's going on today. I'm not in my mind somewhere else. Whenever I'm angry or pissed off or in a negative mood, I'm not in the present. I'm somewhere else in my mind and I'm missing the present. And the day is flying by and I'm missing it. And I'm just, it's just a shitty day. So I do what I can to stay present. Get your mind where your feet are. It, it's easy to get present. Just stop for a second and look around. Just look around. Be quiet, listen to the sound you hear. Feel the temperature. See what you can see right around you. You get present. All of a sudden you start to relax. Your breathing slows down a little bit. You calm down a bit. Your blood pressure probably drops a little, I don't know. But I know you feel better. When I stay present and look for opportunities to be of service and help people out, I have a pretty good day. I feel better and I don't miss the day as it unfolds. There's blessings lined up in every day for you, but if you're in your mind in another time, in the past or in the future or somewhere else, you're gonna miss them. They're gonna float right by, you're not gonna see them because you're not present. If you stay present, when one of those blessings that's lined up for you shows up, you'll be able to grab it and, and, uh, and it will be a blessing for you. So there's your little ditty for the day. Keep your feet, head where your feet are, stay in the present, you're gonna feel better. When you lash out, you feel like shit. When you reach out, you feel good. Remember that, that's pretty simple. It's just two different things. When you lash out, you feel like crap. When you reach out, you feel real good. So reach out and help somebody today. Stay present, be where you are. Get out of your head, you're your own worst enemy. If you can't seem to get out of there, make a phone call, talk to somebody, do something to shake it off, but get out of your head so you feel good. Get out of bed, get out of your head, and have a good coffee day. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good one, over and out. Oh yeah, chummy.